A six-month-old baby was revealed to be the first person to survive an eight-organ transplant on March 18, 2004. While still in the womb, Alessia Di Matteo had been diagnosed with a severe case of a rare and deadly genetic disorder that prevented her body from moving food through her digestive system and emptying her bladder. Medical interventions at birth had mostly failed to improve her underlying condition, and without replacing the affected organs, she was not expected to see out her first year. Though incredibly risky and a relatively new treatment for the condition, transplants had by 2004 already saved or extended the lives of a promising number of children with the same disease. Baby Alessia received a liver, a small and large intestine, a pancreas, a stomach, a spleen, and two kidneys, reportedly all from the same one-year-old donor. Though it took place on January 31st, news of the operation was only released in March after she had recovered enough to leave the ICU. By the fall, she was healthy enough to return home to Italy, but then in January of 2005, she contracted pneumonia, and sadly, during the treatment and recovery from this, she suffered kidney failure and died.